four-wheel drive magazine that I may or may not masturbate over later. This is to stop people jumping over this fence. High security. They've got the gate over here. I wouldn't be surprised if I don't fit through there. Yeah. I've been here for fucking many, many years. My dildo here, look. It's, oh, it's stuck to the fucking... Stuck to the... I thought it was a dildo. We should just fit through here, shouldn't we? Bars. It's a Hawk Valley Golf Cup Golf Club. Was valued at four dollars twenty-five, but now it's worth nothing because they've just thrown it in the bin. Shit. Sponge. Nice for um, prison and shit. Got some knickers and shit that I really don't want to touch. This is a quite nice box actually. Ribbons and shit hanging off it. Look, nice little clasp. Cigarette fucking tray. Ashtray. I could say, the bin actually used to be here and there'd be shit scattered from asshole to breakfast all the way along here. Shit through all here. I used to look for hours with my flashlight, I don't know why. Look, and they filled this in. It used to drop off, so all the shit would blowing to the back where before they had the retaining wall that was what I used to do with my life it's a flower sieve it's for sifting flour sieving sifting so there's probably a part missing from over here but maybe it didn't have it because people were idiots back then and they didn't Prick their fingers on dumb shit like fucking little things coming out. Nowadays, you gotta have a yellow cap or a fucking idiot box on every fucking cunt. This is just for aerating the fucking flour as you're baking it in a cake. No cunt even fucking uses a cake. Everyone's using a fucking cake mix. Like, fuck me. No one even sis flour or anything anymore. So, no cunt would even know what this fucking noise was. So, get fucked, you cunts. This is a big, um, bowl with grapes drawn on it and shit zooming on the keys. Heathy, which of these things doesn't belong here? Hold out your hand. This one, look at this one. That's just old keys. Look at this cunt. It's got a screw on the end of it. It's non-conducive to fucking pulling a cork out. There's not enough grip to pull the cunt. sex toy. Now you push it. Squirts water on your face while the fan goes around. It's just pathetic, mate. This is good. This is a deluxe jigsaw puzzle that's not been opened, so I'm going to be taking this out of the rubbish bin. It's all just bullshit, mate. Records? No. Fucking plates. Don't drink poison, kids. Each year in America, over 13,000 people die through poisoning. It's like 13 million die from fucking drug overdoses, but can't write that in a kid's book. It's not like the old days, mate. I'm happy with this jigsaw book. Look, and lots of tiny little straws, but you, you need to put about 20 together to snort some coke, I think. Show them the bullet-shaped fucking handle. This is Trenchard. See, that's made out of copper. It'll be a butter knife or something like that. So it's in the form of a bullet with spent bullets from the trench. It's called trench art. They used to make uh, model aeroplanes out of the uh, same fucking bullets and the same brass that was from, and they're worth quite a lot of money now for the authentic ones. Anyway, so, where's my body? You don't buy depictions of things of Buddha with only a head. 
I have a lot of respect for Buddha and so you should if you go to uh, Buddhist countries because you can't just go there being a dickhead and like cut someone's head or show them the palms of your feet. You can't People are fucking idiots. You don't even wipe your ass in Thailand. Four hundred years old. How old are you, fuckwit? 108 would be the correct answer in Buddhist years. 108 stairs. 108. So you were too off. Buddha has a big effect on my life because I'm not a fuckwit anymore and like, I don't go around doing dumb shit. Well, not that I remember. You know, fuck. I can still do dumb shit, but if you do it from the right attitude, then that's all right. I love my wife. I get to see her in seven months. No, seven weeks, sorry. Yeah, that sounds heaps better. Fuck yeah. Six and a half weeks, I get to fucking actually see my wife. And that, you bring politics up that I can't even, fuck me. And she even believes that she can't even get another visa. In the meantime, I'm like, bullshit, you're getting another visa. I will tell them, I will Google that shit. You know what I wrote when I was real young? It's called the Tragic Zoo. <laughs> Who comes up with that shit? The Tragic Zoo. I saved a lion in that story. It wasn't really me, but that was, I was pretending that I was betraying this awesome cunt. Like, Save the lion and all the people and that. Oh, I was only six. But the tragic zoo is a good phrase, right? I, I really want to uh, get back to the tragic zoo. Well, the tragic zoo, like, we're all stuck in, like, our little fucking little concrete saviour boxes. You know, it's pretty hard to, like, get out of that but we're fed and we're like, oh, got a plastic tree or something to play with or something like that you know what I mean fucking the tragic zoo like you never escape your own box or you never you never do that it's just safe it's like a sanctuary or a just watch the TV and fall asleep again and wake up that's what I do Wake up, get drunk, go to work, get drunk, uh, come home. Look forward to, but it's looking forward to, look forward to waking up, but you don't really, but look forward to, look forward to going to sleep, look forward to getting drunk, look forward to eating a bit, look forward to going to work, look forward to getting money, look forward to, I can't remember, I was thinking before how I'd say it, but I don't remember now. It's just doing stuff. It's just repetitive behaviour. It's like a tragic zoo, if that makes sense. Had a lot of cocaine. He's got gold basins in his fucking clean, private jet. You know, if anyone could suck my dick, I would let Trump suck my cock. I'd grab him with that hair and just smash his head down towards my balls as deep as it would fucking go. <laughs> That's what I would do. I if I couldn't even blow my load down that fucking fat slug fucking neck of his. Fat to. fucking. Dude. No shit. At least he shaved. Cut that. We're in Australia. We're closer to Thailand. Like, I could just move to Thailand and not get bombarded by fucking atomic bombs. Do you think people just want to suck my cock and kill me? Or nah? Look at my Facebook profile. I'm with some cunt I can't even remember, boy, having the time of my life. My missus is asleep in the hotel room. AIDS and I just spread it all to the cunt. We've got some cups. These are quite expensive. They're made in Norway. It's Lotti or some shit. Figio. Looks gay, but fucking. You sell a plate for 20 bucks. 
Baking dish. But there's better shit. And that. Remove the Pyrex glass where. But look, this is all. And then to present it onto the table, but it's all fucking handcrafted um, brass and copper, like a holder, like it's beautiful. That's pretty nice. But millions of these, it's a rolling pin. You gotta blow the fucking sulfuric acid through the bottom of the fucking glassware, through your, um, through your cook, and then stir the fuck out of it, maybe with one of these, but, um, That'll make that rust like in about two weeks. But you want something like this to very agitate this fucking mixture in there and you want a very fine hose, hardly blow through the cut. Don't suck through it or you're gonna get cancer or something. It's just pathetic. These are quite sharp. Ah, oh, this is one of my favorite. Check that out, the eyewitness. See, it doesn't say eyewitness, it's got an eyeball and then it says witness. This is only a butter knife. Little fucking gay fork. This is an interesting knife because it, it's actually sharpened at the top here. So it looks like more for stabbing, but you build up suction when you stab someone with a knife. So you should never, ever wash. It's just pathetic. Might as well smash it. The love heart means actually two hearts beating together. You can see the light through the cunt. Take it up so you can see the light through the a porcelain. That's how fine the cunt is. See how fine? You know those English teacups that you hold up and they've actually got a watermark on the cunt? You can see the face of the, the king or whatever. Through the base of the teacup, you hold it up to the light. The porcelain is so fine that the sunlight can, or the light can, and this is back in the day when there was no fucking electric light. It's like from, oh, yeah, it was amazing. But they put a fucking watermark in the bottom of a teacup and that shit, it's like two mil. Squirming in my fish man suit because I'm the fish suit man. Choking on forbidden fruit was all part of the plan. Nothing exciting. I'm just over it. The golden age of vending is finished, so that's it.